Hey guys, I'm Cody, the editor of Pie and Past Life Pro. I know it has been a while since my last shader tutorial, almost a month in fact, but no matter. I'm back, and today, I'm here to teach you how to disable underwater blur, or fog if you want to call it that. My friends, let's go do that. First, have the SUSV11 unzipped and ready to work with on the desktop. Access the folder, access the shaders folder, and locate composite2.fsh using Notepad++. It's free, so go download it, open it up. Control G, line 1609. For those who are potentially new to using my tutorials to modify the SUSV11, don't fret. To get rid of a bunch of, specifically, above-water blur, I'd recommend you increase the number from 1.0F to 10.0F. From what I've tested, larger numbers above 10.0F don't seem to make a difference. So that you can understand the effect of this change, here's a comparison starting with before the change and after. Now as you saw, this change did get rid of a lot of blur, but if you look closely, we didn't get rid of all of it. To do that, follow my lead to line 1552. You see the text reading surface.mask.water space two brackets space? To disable completely the above water blur, you'd be expected to delete the text. Though before you do that, do understand that there is a catch. If you remove this text piece, you will also be removing above and below water refraction. It honestly is a little hard to explain what you're taking away, but I guess think of it as the waviness in the water, excluding the actual 3D waves, of course. This you can see from above and below. So this is optional. For people with special cinematic needs, perhaps this can be useful to you. With whatever changes you decide to make, above all, do not forget to save before you check this stuff out in Minecraft. If this SUSV11 tutorial was of any use to you, then do hit that like button. And before you go, don't forget to check out my channel for some more Minecraft tutorials, some pro quality cinematics, and a bunch of other videos that you shouldn't miss. Anyways, I'm Cody, and this is Past Life Pro, where creativity is always a part of my life, as it will be for yours. Alright, see you guys.